Since 2012, Ryan Brady has trained and sold more than 20 horses as a part of his interest and vocation in the equine science industry. Since the age of eight, Ryan has worked with horses. As he matured, he quickly realized that the expenses of running a horse operation would mount quickly, so he decided to build his equine skill levels to be more successful in the business. Ryan buys young horses that are untrained for minimal money, and after several weeks, sells the horses as roping horses for a considerable profit. This has led to an increase in riding, training, and practicing with horses for team roping events. Now, Ryan is a ranked professional and has advanced in skill level through practice, teamwork, and hand-eye coordination. In addition, his responsibilities of taking care of horses on his own has had a positive effect on his work ethic. He has successfully learned the best ways to train a horse to perform as a header or human. He believes that the responsibilities he has learned has strengthened his business management skills. Ryan is a member of the White County FFA chapter where he serves as a chapter officer. He also participated in the Livestock and Poultry Evaluation, CDEs. His FFA advisors are Dustin Keener, Amanda Keener, and Brad Dalton. Congratulations to Ryan Brady, the North Region Star in Agribusiness. For five generations, welding and metal fabrication have been in Stormy Knight's family heritage. It is his livelihood as well. Stormy began working at Advanced Fabrications, a welding and fabrication shop in Toombs County, when he was in the sixth grade. He has since mastered the use of different welding machines and different welding practices and created his own designs and products. Stormy uses a CNC plasma cutter that employs basic computer skills. It is an important part of the day-to-day -day work at this type of facility. He also has learned the skills of MIG and TIG welding. Each job may require a different type of weld, and it's Stormy's job to determine the best way to achieve the final goal. Stormy believes one of his greatest achievements came in the design and fabrication of deer feeders. A problem was diagnosed, then the team at the facility developed a feeder that keeps corn dry and varmints out of the internal feed content. Stormy is an active member of the Toombs County FFA chapter and serves as his chapter president. His FFA advisors are Joey Montford, Tyler Uden, and Mark Montford. Congratulations to Stormy Knight, the Central Region star in agribusiness. Taylor Cross of the Tiff County FFA chapter created a supervised agricultural experience program which consists of purchasing, training, competing with, and selling horses. When she was only three years old, her love of equine began. The initial SAE consisted of raising horses for pleasure. Then Taylor decided to expand her project and purchase horses to train and resell them for profit. She used the winnings from barrel racing to further expand her business to train and compete, proving the horse's value to potential buyers. Throughout the Taylor has qualified for the NBHS Youth World Championship. The event is the largest youth barrel race in the nation. In fact, Taylor placed in the top five and took home prize money in 2015. Taylor has used her experience in the arena to grow more as a business person. She has learned to look for horses that are athletic, big boned, and have good feet with no signs of lameness to create the perfect barrel racing horse. The Tiff County member has also participated in activities such as floriculture, livestock judging, and has brought home countless awards from the Barrel Racing Association. Her FFA advisors are Lynn Cook, Jimmy Cargill, Carl Nichols, Beth Golden, Brittany Schwinn, Eve Rogers, and Heath Cross. Congratulations to Taylor Cross, the South Region star in agribusiness. 